Hello everyone. In this video, we are focusing on side-to-side -side VPN between two checkpoint appliances. The appliances that we are I'm using is checkpoint 1530. As you can see, uh, this is my second checkpoint. I have another one uh, as a, a first checkpoint. So to do side-to-side -side VPN between two checkpoints, you go on the VPN side. First of all, you should check that was the IP address of your remote side. So basically my remote side, you will want to show you, um, this is the IP address of a remote site. I'm bringing this one here. So it is 39, right? So, and the range of local, because it's very important to know that, what is the range of local network? So local network IP address here is in the range of 192.168.1. So one side is one, the other side is uh, 192.168.2. So you go here, add new network, and you put the IP address 142.232.197.39. So that's 39 address. You put the pre-share key. Uh, I put a very simple pre-share key for this one and that's the uh, the network of your remote side which is 192.168.1.0 and to the subnet mask is 255.255.255.0 so i i put here as my network object for example remote uh, local that's naming only here you can put any name uh, because these are two checkpoints you don't need to take care of like um, encryption and the other things but this this one is very important remote sign is gateway is checkpoint and it's very simple here you know uh, you don't need to put anything else you just accept it it's trying to test that. Let's do for the second side that I have here. My second side is still is trying to. Oh, I have another one that I created for forty gate. So this one is uh, is going to be connected to uh, this side, which is I think fifty six, if I'm not right. So I put here. Uh, one four two two three two one nine seven fifty six pre share key a same pre share key between two sides you know and this one um because the network of that network is two zero I put here two five five two five five two zero and you can leave that object for you know doesn't hurt you know this part is the same like because both of both devices are the same they're using the same encryption and um if i'm not wrong about the ip address let me check the ip address also was it 56 yeah it was 56. Uh, so if i'm not wrong then um that other side is trying to test it look vpn tunnel test finished successfully so on the VPN tunnel, you should be able to see the active. And this way, uh, you can actually uh, have a side-to-side -side VPN. You know, this is very cool under this appliance because it create a policy here. And that policy belongs to this one that accept the logs within VPN sites. You don't need to take care of the policy. Also between... Um, NATs between the like uh, side to side VPN usually is disabled, so you don't need to take care of the NAT also here. I hope it has been informative for you guys, and thanks for watching.